First, though, tonight, a local story that has caught the nation's attention. We caught back up with a man who survived a gator attack in the Mayaka River. The 25 year old was out diving for shark teeth when it happened. Now he's showing us the video caught on his GoPro that day. 10 Tampa Bay Shannon Close spoke with him about what happened. Jeffrey Heim is always wearing this GoPro on his head when searching for shark teeth. No two times are the same and you never know what you're going to catch on camera. May 30th, he caught his worst nightmare right through this lens. I never thought this would happen. That was the moment he was attacked by a near seven foot gator in the Mayaka River. And how quickly it hit me. It was just right away, just boom. It got me, no warning, no nothing. Watching this back isn't easy. Very intense for me. It was more stressful than when it happened originally. Each time it brings back the brutal bite memories. But you see the intense struggle watching the moment where you almost died. He suffered several head injuries and had 34 staples holding his head together. But I still remember the pulling. I still remember the force. I still remember just looking at her and changed my life. Now respecting a gator space, choosing not to dive in the Mayaka River. I'm just lucky on all counts that it wasn't worse and I think it hit me in the right spot. Because of that, he says he wants to continue searching for shark teeth. I haven't dove. I would love to dive this weekend. Capturing carefully. There's a reason why you wear that anyways is because no times you go diving or is it the same. For this story's sake, he's making sure of that. I won't be in that river anytime soon. Crazy that he has that video. Now, as for the gator, FWC sent a trapper to capture and kill it. Heim didn't want the gator killed. It turns out he says the gator was bit by another gator and died from its injury.